Inside is the three by four of this sprocket. This is the two by three that I've had for ever. And this is the bigger and, I don't wanna say better, but the bigger and exactly the same one as the other one. It just makes bigger stickers. So let's open it up and see what we got. All right, so text that's always boring. Um, oh yeah, we need photo paper. It's that special zinc paper. It's actually very expensive. However, it has a sticker backing, which is very nice. And yeah, let's see. So we got the three by four and it is sealed over here. Ooh, wow. I mean, I said it was bigger, but this is like massive. I don't know. I'm really excited now. I didn't think it was going to be this big. Um, I mean, do I even know what measurements are? Okay, so this is three by four and a half. And this is five by six and a half. All right then. Okay, so I'm so excited to use this, but I think we're going to have to charge it. I doubt it comes charged right out of the box, especially something this big. I don't even know how long. We might have to charge this overnight and then finish filming tomorrow. I bet these are like a couple sample, uh, what do you call it? Pieces of zinc paper to like get you started. I have no idea what this is. Oh, I guess maybe just a cute logo for you to look at. Join the Sprocket community and get started. Oh, this must be the app. I know, are you excited, Lucky? Even the cat's excited about this. All right, so the good news is the charger looks like it's still the same, and but I have an extra one here just in case. And yeah, so let's fire this up. And as long as we're here, I will open up the other thing of zinc paper they gave me. So 50 pages of zinc paper, which it looks like I just kind of ripped this open this way. Yeah, it's in this. Oh, they're in packs of 10, okay, 10. 20, 30, 40, 50. Yeah, I can do math. All right, but this one only has five. Oh, see, it says five, that says 10. So we will open our five pack up first and start using that. So the thing about these is to, I think it's the same as the other one, to open this, there we go. Look at that. We don't even need to read the directions. Uh, or maybe we do. I don't remember if this goes face up or face down. Let's look at our other one. And maybe that will give us some clue as to which way this goes. Okay, so face up faces the cartridge. So the way to tell face up, this is obviously the backing for the sticker. This is face up. We'll stick these in here. So we don't forget later. And... To download the software, we are simply going to look at that QR code and it should bring up, uh, install the app, oops, app store. Okay, so this should be pretty easy to find. I already have an account. Next, we're gonna go to set up my printer, get started, and we're gonna do Bluetooth and we're gonna select photos from the photo gallery and we're gonna say next. And, oh, good, oh, here we go. Sprocket 3-4. Charge and power on. So it's charged. The power is, I believe, on. Yeah, there we go. It's um. so let's say next. Next, get connected. Uh, yes. And okay. Select an accessory. and setup is complete. Your devices are paired. So now we can choose anything in our gallery. So let's say we wanted to 
All right, so we're gonna pick a cover from my friend Molly because her covers are pretty. And remember, if you wanna learn how to make your own covers, you can do so. Um, she has a course or you can order a cover from her. I don't know why it's tr truncating this and cutting it off, possibly a user error, but we're gonna go ahead and send it. Your photo will now print. So let's wait and see what happens. All right, so let's try, Molly has some other covers that are really cute. And here's another one. And it looks like I can't really resize these. It's not going to allow that. Nope. So, all right, let's compare these in terms of quality, speed, pricing. This one is $129.99 and this one is $79.99. So about a $50 difference. Um, I actually love both of them. I don't know, I guess it depends on what you're using it for. This one seems like it could be more useful because then in theory you could put, say two of these on here and then just cut it down the middle and then you'd have almost like a two for one deal of spending in terms of the amount you'd have to spend on the zinc paper. Uh, in terms of colors, if you look really closely, you'll notice the smaller one is, whoops, a smaller one is a little darker than the lighter one. And I'm not sure if that's just because it got truncated off or the quality, but this definitely seems, the larger one seems to be able to do a little bit better quality when it comes to the colors. Um, in terms of speed, these were both pretty quick. They do get overheated. So that's my one compa complaint about the sprocket. It says that it's overheated and then it'll make you take a little bit of a rest. So if you're trying to print a bunch of those out at once, it does take a little while. And you'll notice here, I was able to resize uh, Molly's cover uh, way better with the two by three than by th three by four. Um, and it does have a big white uh, border around it, whereas you'll notice the smaller one does not. Now that could be a setting that I just didn't see, but I didn't see a way to um, opt out of that. Uh, so even though you have more real estate here, it's a little bit wasted because I really want my photos to bleed to the edge. These kind of remind me of the older Polaroids that you used to get. Um, and here's a photo. And again, you can see the photo quality on the smaller one is just not as great as the one on the left. So this could be a really good uh, photo print. Um, and again, you'll have to make sure though that your pictures are the exact size. Um, and then you can see this over here. All right, there we go. There's our masterpiece of the original of what this originally was supposed to be. Okay, so lots of fun things that you can do with the sprocket. Um, and hopefully this gave you some ideas and I will leave links to this product below if you are interested.